What's up everyone, I'm Becky Johnson, another video now for this one, this is going to be my top three favorite horror franchises of all time. Now, like, I love all three of these franchises, that's why these are my top three. These are the franchises that I could rewatch any time of day and just love them every single time. So, yeah, with that being said, this is my top three favorite horror franchises of all time. Now, number three. We have The Conjuring Universe. Now, I'm a massive fan of this franchise. The Conjuring Universe franchise. I'm a massive fan of this franchise. Now, the only one I really didn't like, even though it had some good things about it, but it's still my least favorite to this day, is the first Annabelle. But there are some things I like about it. But, like, I'm, I'm, I'm probably planning on doing a review series for the um, Conjuring um, Universe franchise. So... Yeah, um, you have Annabelle Creation, which is, I love this movie. Um, I had a feeling that they brought, you know, Annabelle back good. Like, they, see, in this movie, they made Annabelle good. The first one, huge mistake. This one, they redeemed themselves. That's what I was trying to say. So, yeah, um, next we have Annabelle Comes Home, which is, Good movie, you know. Some people might not like it, but I enjoyed this film because they had that great mood and atmosphere in it. You had the warrants in it at times, but this had a really good story. I enjoyed this movie. Then we got The Conjuring 1 and 2. Great movies. Cannot wait for The Conjuring 3. See, my, my most anticipated horror movie is the next year, which is, which is, I don't know if The Conjuring 2 got, gets delayed yet, but I'm, I'm expecting it being delayed. So if it does come out next year, my, the two, my most anticipated horror movies the next year will have to go to Halloween Kills and um, The Conjuring 3. So, yeah. Um, you have The Curse of La Llorona, which is... I heard a lot of people don't like this film. I enjoyed this film. This film has some great, great, um, great, like, cinematography and everything. This The story was not that great, but the jump scares were actually pretty cool, you know. Um... And the moon and atmosphere and everything was great. <clears throat> then you get The Nun, which a lot of people also hate this film. Then again, like the only bad one in the College of Universe in my eyes is probably the first Annabelle. But yeah, um, The Nun, I enjoyed this film. You know, the, um, it was effective. The music choices in this film was creepy as hell. And you had some great jump scares and you had some great... Great mood and atmosphere. This film has some great mood and atmosphere, and um, and stuff. And they made everything in the um, Conjuring universe connect together. It's also like how they do with this um, Conjuring universe. I, I'm a huge fan of this series, and I cannot wait to see the um, Conjuring three. I just cannot wait to see that film. I know it's going to be really good. Now coming in at my number two is. Is um hold up a second now is the um Child's Play franchise now um shit Child's Play franchise now like there's only really one Chucky movie I do not like and that is Seed of Chucky. Everything else in the Child's Play franchise, I love. You know, the original is always going to be my favorite. And I've talked about this a lot. Why it's my favorite. Like, like I just, I'm talking about a lot because this is my favorite one. A lot of people always put Child's Play 2 as the number one. I can understand that, but like, the, oris this one, the original should always be number one most of the time, you know. Because this one is just as iconic as the original Halloween. And this one should be at the number one spot locked up. I know it's all opinions, but the way this movie was made people scared of dolls and everything. This is the one that started it all. And this movie is my favorite, and it's always going to be my favorite Chucky movie. Unless they, unless the new ones come out, and then, and then it somehow tops it. You know, which is, it could. You never know. I always have faith. Like, I always have faith. So, Child's Play 2 is my second favorite in the franchise. You know, Child's Play 1 and 2, 
I consider masterpieces because you can watch them. It's kind of like Halloween, what they did with Halloween. You can put Halloween 1 and 2 in, and it'll be like the one big gigantic movie. That's sort of what this is, you know, because you can put in Joshua 1 and 2, and it'll be like one big gigantic movie. Because this one leaves off immediately after the original Child's Play. Because, you know, Chucky's burnt, they scrape all that burnt stuff off of him and stuff. And then, um,. And Child's Play 3 is pretty good. Like, this is my Child's Play collection right here. You know, I end up, um, bought these two. I mean, even though I already had all the Chucky movies, I bought these two a while back. Um, one time around October a while back. And the reason I bought these two because I want to add to my collection because, you know, Chucky is my second favorite horror franchise of all time. And, um, so yeah, like, like, I had to give this to my collection because I just had to, you know. I'm a huge Chucky fan, so yeah. Then I got the six, this box collection. Um, one of my favorite Chucky movies, actually, Curse of Chucky is really good. Curse of Chucky is spectacular, actually. You know, this is one when Chucky um kind of wins and kind of don't at the same time because of the in credit scene that Annie shoots him but like Chucky still kind of wins at the end of the day in Curse of Chucky because Nico sort of went to the mental institution like in this movie you thought she go to jail but we all know in Cult of Chucky she went to the mental institution pretty much Chucky wins at the end of the day so yeah um and that's that's a good twist about it and um it's the Bride of Chucky is a really good movie and everything like to me, the only bad Chucky movie is Cedar Chucky. Then we get to Colt the Chucky, which is, this movie does have mixed reviews. I enjoy this film because why? It's brutal. They did something a little different. And, um, and, uh, they had some great mood and atmosphere in with this film, too. And it's very brutal. And then I also like how three Chuckies come to life. But I didn't like how they explained it. That's the only issue. That was the only one issue. Have with it. I don't have much of anything issues with it, you know. Even though this is in my top three favorite Chucky movies, you know, my number one is of course the original. My number two is Child's Play Two, and this is in my top three. But there's some things that could have made it even better, like um, even better in this film. But I still enjoy this film quite a bit. It's it's in my top three. So yeah. Well, no, not anymore. It ain't in my top three anymore because of why. Still in my top five though. Still at my number four. But because of why? Child's Play Remake. A lot of people hate this film. A lot of people hate this film. Um, which is I don't get it because they try to do something different in the Child's Play franchise. This is the only I feel I have a feeling that this is the one of the only franchises they try to do something different, like horror franchises. Because in each movie they do something a little bit different. And the remake is freaking amazing. I enjoy this film a lot. So yeah, that's why Child's Play franchise is my number two spot. Favorite horror franchises. Now coming in at my number one spot is a lot of y'all probably guessed it, and that is the Halloween franchise, of course. And, and it, I'm bummed out that we have to wait an entire year for Halloween Kills to come out. Um, but we got all these movies to watch for right now. So there's to me, there's more good Halloween movies than bad Halloween movies. There's like two, maybe three. I don't like in the franchise, but mostly all the movies in this franchise are good. Mostly. So yeah, the original Halloween classic. This John Carpenter's Halloween score is classic. Halloween 2, leave off immediately after the original Halloween. Halloween 3, it's okay. Halloween 4 and 5. Halloween 4 is probably, it might be my, one of my favorites, if not my favorite Halloween film. Halloween 4. But Halloween 5, they messed that up a little bit. And you have Halloween, Curse of Michael Myers, Halloween, H2O, Halloween Resurrection here. Rob Zombie's Halloween. I enjoy Rob Zombie's first remake. 
Rob Zombie's Halloween 2. This film, there are some things I liked about it. Can you get the Halloween 2018? Love this film. I talked about it a lot. I love this movie. And I'm pretty sure the Halloween Kills is probably going to top it somehow. If not, a lot of people say, oh, it ain't going to be as... Like, people keep saying, oh, it ain't going to be the best one still, though. You know, the original is going to be the best one. We don't know until we see the movie. People just want to always think that the original is the best one. Of course, it's always going to be a classic. But, you never know if a sequel could top it. You never know. Like, a lot of people think Child's Play 2 is the best one in the franchise, for example. Even though it's my number two favorite, a lot of people consider... Child's Play 2 as the best Child's Play movie in the franchise. So what if Halloween Kills ends up being an example of that? To where it's better than even the original. What if it does that? It could. It could. And that would be freaking amazing. If it does that, you know that they're going to make billions of dollars off that. Because a lot of people love the original the best. The original probably is my favorite. Sometimes they go on and off between Halloween 4 and the original Halloween. Because both of them are freaking masterpieces in my opinion. And um and stuff and I do love Halloween 2018. So there's a lot I'm excited for in Halloween Kills. So yeah, that's why Halloween is my number one favorite in the horror franchise. Um, my favorite. So yeah, I guess that's it for this video. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button, please subscribe and share. And also hit the bell so you know when, when a new video is uploaded. Peace out. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm out. Peace.